Good morning, guys. Uh, today is Wednesday, November the 2nd. And I got paid, so everything's looking good. Everything's looking good. So, how is everybody? Doing good? Okay, good. So, the plan for today is school this morning. We've got chemistry this morning, and then an English class, which I forgot that paper. I told myself, Nathan, don't forget that paper. I went back in my room to get that paper to get that paper. So I to go back and get it. Have to. Great. Anyway. This is, this is what I go through on a daily basis. Oh well. It's not that far back home. And uh, today, most likely, most likely, I know I've said this for a couple days now, will be the day that I go buy a car. If, if I decide to get the car that I've got picked up. That is, that's a big if, if I decide to get that car. Uh, that if I do decide to get that car, then uh, we'll go get it this evening. Because I've got everything set up. That's it. So I'm going to go back and get that. I'll talk to you guys on the way back. Okay, okay, good, good. I just got so mad. This guy waited, literally waited, until the cars got there to pull out. So I would not be able to pull out. He waited, he waited like a minute and a half for cars just so I wouldn't be able to pull out. That made me so mad. Why do people have to do stuff like that? I don't understand it. It just bothers me. End of the day. I'm already down. It ain't even, it ain't even 8.30. <sighs> I had to go get my paper. I had to, I had to write a uh, three to four page uh, rhetorical analysis of any of the essays or whatever we were stuff we've read in that book in English class and I picked uh, I have a dream speech by Martin Luther King Jr. It turned up really well. I actually liked it. So yeah, uh, it was a great speech. Nobody can deny the fact that it was a great speech. So I'm running in like five minutes late. Not anything huge. I should be in class, should be in class in time. <sighs> well, I'm hoping today is the day for that car. Because I'm tired of trying to sit back and trying to make a decision. And people are telling me not to get the car. Some people are telling me I shouldn't take out a loan. And I'm like, how am I supposed to get credit if I don't take out a loan? I mean, yeah, there's downsides to taking loans, but you have to do it. And they're like, one guy told me, he said, what about job security? Well, that's, that's like asking me, what if I die tomorrow? What if I, you know, what if I die while I have the car? What if I get in a coma or something? I mean, it's things you can't foresee. You can't put things you can't foresee and foresee in your, um, your plans. I mean, yeah, you can do minor stuff, but big stuff you can't put in there. You can't, you can't plan for that kind of thing. Nobody can, so you just have to take chances in this life. And that's one of them that you definitely have to take is when you decide if you want to get a loan for a car. Anyways, I will see you guys after this first class. I'm pretty sure people are trying to give me a breakdown today. I'm going to wait for this parking spot, and... There was a guy parked in like two parking spots. Who does that? And two, two people walking walking in the middle of the road. That's why they make sidewalks. I'm done. Well, hello there. I'm in the car with uh, that one. And we went to Best Buy to look at some, she had to take something back and I looked at some car audio. So, uh, I'm not going to get a sub or anything like that because one, I can't handle all the sub bass. I want bass, but not that much. So maybe a 10 or something like that. Something small. 
uh, looking at that, and I looked at a, uh, well, that sounds bright. I looked at a, uh, what was it, a brand name, that Pioneer? It was a Pioneer, uh, touch screen thing, navigation thing. I liked it, and it was fairly cheap, and it would fit the car, so we'll, we'll see. That's not going to be anything soon or anything like that, so we'll just see. We'll see. So we're going to go get some Chinese food, because we're hungry. We hungry. Feed us. Ah, get it? Feed us? <laughs> uh, I'm in a good mood. Well, hello there. Old money here. No, I'm kidding. Um, got out of class. Easy day, pretty much. Um, I'm going to go home, rest a little bit, and wait for mom to get home. <laughs> Because when mom gets home, we decide if um, if we're going to go do that car deal. So, fingers crossed, everything works out. Because I've decided, decided, I want that car more than any other car. And that's what I want. That's what I want. That's it. Final. You've got the decision right there. Right there is the decision. I want you for the army. So, yeah. That's the decision, guys. And, you know, there's other cars out there. But I'm a teenager, you know? You can't expect me to think too practical. You know, you gotta take chances in life. That's all I'm gonna say. You gotta take chances in life, and if you want what you really want, go for it, because you only live once. That's just the way I see it. You gotta take chances in life. Life isn't about waiting around to see maybe this happens, maybe you'll never get anything in life if you do that. I mean, we're put here to enjoy life. Life isn't supposed to be miserable. If it was meant to be miserable, why would we be here? You know, that's the way I see it. I'm not going to be miserable. I'm going to live life, have fun, be who I want to be. And that's what it is. That's what it is, guys. That's what it is. I'll see you guys in a little bit. <sighs> Seems like mom is never going to get home. Gosh, I'm dying here. I've been sitting here for an hour and a half. I'm starting to get a headache. Thinking about all this car stuff. I gotta keep it. <laughs> no. I'm just waiting on mom to get home so we can go get done. Well, that was an awful face. Hey guys, um, I'm on my way over to the car dealership. I went over to the bank and uh, got everything set up for the loan. Um, it's some little lurking things that we had to get done. Um, put in an application for a loan today. So we're not gonna get the car today as much as I thought I was going to. So we're gonna go, I, got, I put in an application for the loan to one of probably no, in the morning. Uh, whether or not we are approved for the loan completely if I need a co-signer, which I probably will. So we'll get that done and um, I'll go over there in the morning probably in between classes. So we'll get that done and um, right now I'm going to go over here and do some negotiations with the dealer and hopefully test drive the car. So. That's what we're going to do. I'm in the Toyota, my trading car. Um, I'm going to go over there and get them to appraise this. And I've got a set price for this one that I'm going to stick with. And I can't go any lower than that or I won't be able to buy the car. And I'm going to let him know. I mean, I, I want the car. I do. I do. I want that car. But I can't go any lower than what I've got set in my mind on this trade in. So. That's it for right now. Uh, I'm having these pains shoot through my head. I've been stressing myself too much over this. It's, it's bad. It's getting bad. So hopefully we can calm down a little bit. It's just everybody in the house is woohoo right now. I'm like woohoo, woohoo. You know, come on. I mean, it's just everybody in the house is going ache lately. So we'll see, guys. Wish me luck. I'm test driving the car. It drives like nobody's business. Here, watch this. Ready? 
I'm like a school girl right now. I just bought this car. We're good. This is my car now. So, no more driving in the truck. So this is what it is, guys. Um, more. I'll, when I get home, I'll take a big video of it. See you guys in a little bit. Hey guys. Uh, let me turn this right here um, I'm on my way to church. I'm getting stares out the butt right now. <laughs> this thing is sweet. I mean, just sweet. It's the, it, this is going to be the best car I own, I think. If Ford's wheeling, this will be the best car I've ever had. Well, this is the best car I've ever had so far. It just drives so smooth. Here comes the bump, guys. The one I always jump on. Better. Better. Much better. So I'm on my way to church. I'm running a little tad bit late because I was finishing up some paperwork. But anyway, I like it. It's really nice. So I'll see you guys in a little bit. Well, guys, uh, everybody likes my car. And uh, she's with me. We're testing out the heated seats right now. So I'm going to stop by Walmart and fill up this car. Uh, I'll, I'll make a video tomorrow if I get a chance of all the features on it and stuff. So I may just make a separate video for that. We'll see. That way I can record it in HD. So we'll see. Uh, for right now, I'm going to go fill up the gas tank and pick up an iPod connector. But for right now, I'll leave you with this. So this is a good night. This is uh, zero to, this is like 40 to 60 right here. 75. It's a beast. Night, guys. Adios. Peace out, Captain.